He put his life on the line every day fighting fires across Houston, and then Captain Tommy Searcy fought an even greater battle with the coronavirus. He lived and died a fighter and a hero. And today, Searcy's family was joined alongside his firefighting family in a memorial filled with tributes and memories. Brandon Walker is live at Champion Forest Baptist Church in Northwest Harris County with more for us. Brandon. Yeah, Lauren, and in many ways, the two aren't mutually exclusive of one another, the firefighting family and the, 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 the blood family. And because in this case, the case of the Searcy family, there was Captain Tommy Searcy, but also Captain Tony. They started together, yet today, HFD Captain Tony Searcy was given his twin brother's retired badge. Story has it, Captain Tommy Searcy wanted to fight fire so badly that as soon as both brothers turned 18. The first Thursday afterwards, they signed up. And as we can say, the rest is history. Robert Delgado, HFD's chaplain, whose task today was to tell stories of Tommy, shared from fellow firefighters. He was a hero, a leader, a mentor. He was a hell of a fireman over and over again. And in the middle of all that firefighting stuff was also, he was a great dad. Kaylin, Krista, and Kinley each received one of their dad's helmets from each of the fire departments from which he served. Captain Searcy touched lives, saved countless ones too, including fellow firefighters. We've lost three this year to COVID-19. Captain Searcy may be gone, no longer fighting fires, but with that final salute comes new beginnings. Because he wants to be a firefighter when he grows up. That's what Lisa Perry and grandson Chris want Captain Searcy's family to know. He's eight, draped himself in the flag to say goodbye. I don't want to be a firefighter like him, and I'm sorry. And I'm sorry, so don't worry. He was able to make his way back home to finish his virtual learning assignments, but he said he had to be out here. And Grandma said he wants to be a firefighter so much, and Captain Searcy touched so many lives that he had to be out here to say goodbye. We're live in Northwest Harris County. I'm Brandon Walker, KPRC Channel 2 News.